Submarine volcanoes are underwater cracks or vents where magma bursts through the Earth's mantle. Their eruptions are frequent and important events, yet they are rarely observed because often they occur in deep water. For the first time, scientists have used hydroacoustic data to reconstruct images of an underwater volcano's eruption. The researchers monitored a 2011-2012 eruption off the coast of El Hierro, the smallest of the Canary Islands. Because the eruption occurred in shallow water, the scientists were able to monitor its hydroacoustics and convert the hydroacoustic data into images and models of what was happening inside the volcano. They also used a remote operating vehicle to collect rock samples after the eruption had finished. The scientists observed the two main growth phases of the volcano, which were separated by collapses in the rock. At some points during the eruption, magma burst out and the ocean surface bubbled, while at other times, magma slowly oozed out of the vents. As the magma cooled, it caused a variety of formations, including large aprons along the volcano's slope, lava balloons, which floated to the ocean's surface and sank down after cooling, lava ponds, lava tubes, and chimney-like structures called ornitos at the volcano's summit. Over the course of the event, a new volcano named Tagoro grew 286 meters toward the surface of the ocean.